So next to go with the competitors coming in here, thick and fast. And what a waste. That's next to go, what a waste of your catalogs, ladies and gentlemen. Is Cutstown. Cutstown is an 8 year old gallery. Well, a very sign that said that the sport was very by Cavalier Royale. Cutstown. Laura Ivanov. So well done, well done indeed to Rosemary Morris and Touchdown. Some special horses in this class, ladies and gentlemen, horses that would grace the hunting fields of any pack of hands in the country. Great to see horses that have got the, the ability to match them.
So we're going to have snow rider speeds to trot on. Trot on, please. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> So we're going to ask all of our riders please to catch her on, catch her on please, thank you. So thank you very much riders, we just ask you to return to walk please and just line up in the centre of the arena, just in any order please, thank you. So our ride judge, Rory Gilson, is going to ride each of these nine horses that have come forward. These are the nine horses who managed to go clear in the jumping phase of this working under glass. With no means beat in itself as well because Kevin Melman and Derek Hamilton really set these horses and riders a good test. This is our second to the last class of the day for working class awards. We've just got one more class to come after this. That will be class 17 for Mary's Melvins and Stallions, 5 to 10 years of age, capable of carrying over 13 stone. So in other words, the heavyweight working class horses will be the fourth and final working under class of the day. So our ride right judge here, Rory Gilson, moving very swiftly and economically through this lineup of Seven to ten year olds. Currently putting Cooks down through his paces. Cooks down is 108. Henry he comes and he is an eight year old play gelding. Our Hadaverian Sar looks at. This horse will be by Laura Ivan of Gory in the county of Ring two for the class 16. This is for seven to ten year old working hunter horses, mares, geldings, and stallions. And the winner, once all the marks have been added up, the winner, ladies and gentlemen, is Felicity Pierce's John McConnell Master.
and Victoria Clark. Master, In master. second place, Emily McGowan's EMS Raquel's Pet. In third place, number 108, Lady Perdita Blackwood's Cutstown, oh, written by Rosemary Morris. Fourth prize goes to Laura Kelly's HL Marley and Me. In fifth place, Antonia de Berg's Gypsy Cobra Cruise. The reserve prize goes to Bob O'Keefe's Shanna Gore Lusty, written by Alice Popperborn. We've also got a highly commended prize as well. And that has been awarded to Anne Lambert's Goran Allo, number 576. So very many congratulations here to our winner of this our third four working hunter horse classes here throughout the day in ring two. This is for the seven to ten year old lightweight horses. And their winner, Felicity Pearson's John McConnell Master, written this afternoon by Victoria Clark. And this horse is a nine year old gelding by Master Rip, out of a mare by Philip Clover, the Dame Nari Shaft mare. The winning horse was bred by Thomas Purcell for the Kilmana in County Kilkenny. He'll be coming back here a little bit later on for the Working Hunter Horse Championship, as will our runner up, Emily McGowan's EMS McGowan's pet, seven year old mare by Lock Cruz. What's the mare by Kings, runner up, Red in County Danny Gold by Willie McElhenney. But for now, let's have a big round of applause for all of our prize winners. That's a cover, Hull Horse, isn't it? It's our third and ultimate working horse class of the day. Most generously sponsored by our good friends from Ronaby Construction. When you head there, lads, so come down with it. Nice, thank you. Working horse class coming up next, that is class 17. That is the five to ten year old mares, geldings and stallions, anyway horses. Hold on, Victoria. Good job, Alex. Hold on, there's my...